Representative Dean Phillips criticized President Biden for the latest survey figures on Saturday and argued that it was delusional to think that former President Trump could pass in a rematch. As a member of the Democratic leadership house, supported Biden agenda and introduced it to the Phillips Platform X on Saturday. I campaigned for him, voted for him and respected him. But how can he read it and conclude that he positions Donald Trump to defeat? The authority focused on Biden's decline in his approval ratings by sharing an article from Politico. Politico analysis piece. Only in November. 13 separate survey results in the survey results of the president's position fell to all except two. He said, Minnesota Democrat has faced a violent reaction since Biden's re-election campaign has long announced its primary challenge. In an interview in the early this month, Phillips defended his decision by pointing to Biden's historically low approval ratings. In addition, Biden said that Biden was facing the same conditions and compared the officials of Jimmy Carter in 1980. Biden confirmation numbers are historically low. Only Jimmy Carter, who was Ed in this election, Phillips said to CNN. One of the problems affecting Biden's questionnaire numbers is that he deals with the war between Israel and Hamas. Phillips became an openly an oral critic of his response. A temporary ceasefire started on Friday morning and Hamas gave four days to return to 50 hostages. In exchange for the release of more than 100 Palestinian prisoners, including young people, he argued that U.S. special forces had to play a hand in removing the Americans who were captured by militant group. The first hostages were released on Friday. But no American was released. Phillips' last rebuke's last rebuke. After explaining that deputy will not be re-elected to the home seat, he claims that it is time to pass torch. Phillips wrote to X on Friday, This was most cheerful experience of my life which represented the most civilian occupational community in Congress. But our time to pass the torch. The time of change and our best days have not yet come. He added.